Hello and welcome back to Let's Play Super Mario RPG with Classic Gamer Dave. And we're back in Seaside Town and apparently we are gullible. And I don't know about you, but I'm sort of irritated with this elder guy. Uh, but apparently we don't know who he is. Who are you, man? You're Ridovich? A member of the Smithy Gang? Oh no, that's why he wants the star. Shocked? Well, yeah. How was I supposed to know who you are? It's not like you're famous or anything, like a classic Mario character. If maybe you'd been like... Uh, I, I don't even know, man. You can't just pretend that you're so well-known or anything. Don't you know who I am? I'm your Ridovich. I'm like, oh, of course. How did I not see that? <laughs> your search for the stars has worried Smithy. Yeah, I'd be worried if I was him too. Uh, brownie points? Great. I'm, I'm glad that you'll get brownie points from this. Okay. It's futile to try and fight me, so just hand it over nice and easy. What? Get serious, dude. Like, I'm afraid of you. Okay. Now, honestly, um, you want to say okay right away. And I'll tell you why later. But for now, uh, I'm go I've made a save state so that I can come back to here. But I'm going to show you what happens when you say, get serious. So that's how you want to play it. What do you think will happen to the real inhabitants of Seaside Town? Oh, what is, what's he going to do? Oh, it's the real elder. Oh, no. No, stop, guys. No! Heck. What did he do to him? Oh, man, there must be some shameless twerk. Tickled. An innocent old man <laughs> being tickled? <laughs> oh, that's incredible. Oh, get serious. All right, I, and then he sends two guys in. Oh, no. You know you wouldn't. The two you're going to... No, please not the... Oh, my God, what's happening? I... <laughs> Oh my god. It's a shame that he's being tickled, yes. No way, man. There's no way I'm gonna hand over this. Oh no, four? Huh. You can't treat me this way. Ah! <laughs> oh my god. I can't bear this. Oh my god. <laughs> I forgot. About all this, oh! I think I think at this point it's the same thing each time. Yeah, it's four again, and it's just that. I think I think you passed out from all the tickling. Okay, now I'm going to uh, reload the save state and just say okay right away. So I'll be right back. Okay, we're back, and we're just gonna say okay because. Uh, it helps us later in the end, and we don't have to witness the elder being tickled. Oh, that was that was pretty that was pretty bad. Uh, you didn't even have to soil your hands. Yeah, it's not not too bad. Yeah, scary. No wonder I'm so important. Turning to the castle, a ride should be here by now. So if that's a disguise, uh, let's run after him. Then I wonder what what he really looks like. And what his uh, cronies there look like? Blade. It's taking him so long. Who's Blade? <laughs> well, it wasn't that far away. I'm a. Sh I'm like. All these characters are like. Oh, he caught up with us already. It's like if I walked to the end of the end of a hallway and was like, "All right, we gotta wait for this person, and then we can make a jump for it." Rust a little. He's gonna rust if he swims? What the heck is this guy about? Not so fast. The star's a gift to me, mate Mario. Nice, Johnny on the spot here. Oh, I just came up with the LP title, I think. Spinous dogs have no code of honor. We'll make you walk the plank. Uh, parlay. Parlay. Yeah, now you can't hurt him. I think that's what Yuridovich did, because Johnny doesn't help us. 
Well, I mean, he keeps them from running away, but... Take off the disguises now. Group formation. What? Oh my god, it's like the Power Rangers. God, what? I love this game's enemy design. I think it's amazing. There, I said it. Like, I think bosses should look crazy like this. Okay, so this is Yuridovich, and I remember the first time I fought him, I had a hell of a time with him. But back then, I also uh, was very underleveled, because I didn't like battling, and I would just skip every possible battle I could. I would only fight if I ran into an enemy and absolutely had to. So I was severely underleveled, A, and B, I didn't know really about Peach's healing stuff, and I just used pick-me-ups when somebody died, and that was really... That was really the extent of my battle knowledge. I wasn't very good at RPGs. This was like one of my first real RPGs. I didn't get into Final Fantasy until, uh, like, in nearly high school days, which was like 2001, maybe? But yeah. Okay, so uh, this is Yuridovich, and... Um, he has 1,500 HP, which really isn't a lot, honestly. I kind of wish he had more. Um, and, yeah, 1,500 HP. Uh, his defense is... Special defense is, all, like, all the statuses, basically. And, actually, I'll do group heal, might as well. Um, and he's weak to thunder, so... Yeah, this whole, this whole section from Star Hill... From after you get the star at Star Hill to now, you want melee in your party, I think would be a good idea. But, eh, too late now. Okay, so this section, there is a real Yuridovich, and he made a clone Yuridovich. Now, when you press the attack button, it, the cursor will immediately go over the real one, so don't even bother switching to the other one. Because um, that one's the fake, and any damage you do to it, won't go towards the damage for your division at all. It'll just go towards the clone, which doesn't mean anything at all. It won't win the battle, essentially. Okay. Ooh, Bowser's about to die. I didn't even see that. Um, he's not weak to super jump, but I'm trying to get the uh, 100 super jumps. I'm gonna... After I'm done with this LP, I'm gonna attempt a bonus video of a hundred of a hundred jumps in the super jump because I've always, always wanted to do that, and I've never had the patience to actually try to do that. So that's that's gonna be. It won't happen right away. I promise you that. I'll promise you that. But every time I sit down and make an attempt, I'm going to record my attempt, and if I never get it down, I just simply won't save that recording. And that's going to be my uh, my way of doing that. And if I never get it, the bonus video will never happen, obviously, but if I do get it, yeah, then that's going to be awesome. And I've always wanted to do it, so it's, it's not like it'll be wasted time for me. This is just giving, this uh, video is giving me an incentive to do it, so all the more power to that. Now, by the way, I really love this battle scene. Um, it just, it looks great. I just think it's amazing. I, every aspect of this game I just find to work really well together. Like, it's an RPG that doesn't take itself too seriously, and I just think that's awesome. Because some do that don't don't really have um, anything to back that up. But hey, we won. Yeah, he's he's not too bad, Yuridovich. But that that whole sequence is so funny. Uh, Smithy is now in the race for the star pieces. What horrible surprises might he have in store for Mario? Well, only time will tell. Only time will tell. Oh, a key. Shed key. Oh, that must be where the elder is. What's this note say? To Mario, knowing you, it must have been a breeze knocking down Yared. I love, I love, I love how he gave him a nickname. Oh, Yared, like he knew him. 
gosh. By the way, my part saw a huge axe flying across the sky. It's probably one of Smithy's nasty friends. Go get him, pal. Well, my gills are failing me, so I'm heading back down, dropping when you ever have time. Okay. Um, I remember when I was little, I was just like, oh, maybe I will drop down. So I, I went back there, and he literally says nothing. Like, he's just like, I can't remember what he says. But it literally was one line of text. And, like, oh, good to see you, or something stupid like that. Maybe, I'm, I'm pretty sure that wasn't it, or it wasn't anything like that. But still, it was just like, what? All that work I went through, and you're not even going to say anything. But yeah, uh, let's uh, go back to the world map here. And, oh, okay. Uh, oh, yeah, we have to talk. We have to let the guys out of the shed. What am I thinking? Alright. Knock, knock. Oh, yeah! Oh, there's a mole here. Thanks so much. You're welcome. Dirty? Yeah, well, it is a shed. It's a pretty nice looking shed. I mean, it looks like the stores. <laughs> Out of a bind? Yeah, no problem. It was mighty unpleasant in here. Thanks for helping us out. Oh, you're welcome. You're welcome, you're welcome. Stop by. Oh, you guys must be the store owners. Thanks for freeing us. Okay, see ya. Too bad she doesn't give us a discount for freeing her. Gosh. Oh, I... I did it for the star. I don't act like I was doing anything for you. <laughs> You expose the fake towns people. They're pretty obvious, honestly. Uh, and that, this right here, is why you want to say yes right away. Because you get a flower box. Each time you say, get serious, this diminishes. And so the next time it'd be a flower, if you pressed it, get serious once, it'd be a flower jar. And then if you press it twice, it'd be a flower tab. And then I'm not sure if he'd give you anything after that. I don't know. Um, but yeah. Might as well get the flower box. And I'm going to use that right now, actually, while I'm thinking about it. Yeah, five points. That's definitely worth having. I wouldn't be surprised if we got 99 flower points by the end of this LP. I'm pretty sure you can't get more than 99. So... It's not like you can go into the hundreds. Beazarus. Yeah, don't worry about that right now. Um, there's one thing I want to do before we end the episode. First, and... Uh, we... Af While I'm thinking about it, I just don't want to forget about it. Because I forget about it every time. Oh, and something I always fail to mention. Alright, for... <laughs> before, before I get on that subject, okay. Remember from the mines, I found some neat stuff in the miner store. Particularly, what I got to sell. The lucky jewel. Sure, I'll take it. I got plenty of money. Mystery egg. Cool. Okay, I'll buy it. Um, and this is all stuff that um you might as well have. I, I don't know what I'm trying to say. Oh, oh, earlier. Uh. Remember when we first got Gino, and after we defeated Boyer and went back? If you go back to the inn, after you defeat Boyer and talk to the kid at the end, he gives Gino the star shot. Actually, I'm going to show that now. I think I can still show that. But we bought it in the store instead. And, yeah, I, I wasn't thinking. Usually, I always go back, but I was so in such a hurry to press on that I didn't do that. Oh, okay. Never mind. Maybe I went through that scene already earlier in the LP or something and forgot about it, but... Or maybe it just was like, alright, if you're not gonna come back, whatever. Anywho, let's go talk to the Elder and end this sh she's -ite. Hello? Uh, hey. The star you're looking for I might be able to help you. The far side of Lands End Town made up of reformed monsters? Oh, that's kind of interesting. Oh, they have a star there! Oh, we'll have to go there. So the... Town of Reformed Monsters. Sounds like a Godzilla film. <laughs> I don't know exactly where the town's located, but if you follow the road, you'll get there. Cool. Thank you, Mr. Elder, sir. And, uh, yeah. With that, 
Uh, alright, yeah. Welcome to the next continent of the game. That last one was pretty short, <laughs> honestly, as far as they go. But yeah, this one's a bit longer. I'll tell you that much. Land's End, here we go. This is the start of the final lap of the journey, as far as, my, as, far as I'm concerned. Start of the final lap. Alright, so yeah, this is Classic Gamer Dave signing out, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye bye